Prince William reunites with former roommate in emotional video, It's Been a While. Prince William reunited with his former roommate whilst visiting Wrexham Football Club in Wales, emotionally noting that it's been a while. The Prince of Wales made a television appearance on Welcome to Wrexham where he spoke about visiting the successful football team in celebration of St. David's Day. During the episode, which aired May 30, William met up with Wrexham FC co-chairman Rob McKelleny at a local pub, as well as Humphrey Kerr, the executive director of the series and former roommate of the Prince. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. In a confessional scene, Kerr said, I went to school with Prince William. I have known him since I was seven, or something like that. We literally shared a bedroom from seven until ten. As boys, both attended Ludgrove School and then Eton College. Shaking hands, William noted that it had been a while since they last saw each other. Kerr said that the Prince was here because of St. David's Day, before lamenting the fact there is no day off to celebrate the event, labeling it a bit of a swizz. He said, as Prince of Wales, Prince William has got to come and press the flesh, kiss babies and do all that sort of business that princes do. For us, it's great that Wrexham Football Club and Wrexham as a whole has become a place the royals put on their itinerary when they're coming to visit Wales. Praising the work done to revitalize the Welsh Football Club, Prince William said, it's great what you guys are doing, it really is. Addressing it's always sunny in Philadelphia star McKelleny and Kerr, he added, you give so many football fans, whose team maybe is not in the glory days that they want to be or used to be, the hope and the optimism that one day you can be back. Prince William is not the only royal to have hung out with Wrexham FC. His brother, Prince Harry, was pictured with McElhenney and his co-star Glenn Howerton back in January. The three posed for a selfie whilst attending a football match between Inter Miami CF and Los Angeles at the FCBMO Stadium in LA. The crowd was full of A-listers including Leonardo DiCaprio, Selena Gomez, Owen Wilson, and Jason Sudeikis. The match was a success for Inter Miami CF, who won 3-1 against Los Angeles. McElhenney's Instagram caption, which featured a carousel of photos including the selfie with Harry Reid, aside from that slight allergic reaction to the nuts, 2023 was one of the best years of my life. Thank you to the people and places that made it possible. My life is full of love and joy because of you. So excited for 2024. I'll stay away from the nuts. The King and Queen have also met the co-chairs, with McKelleny sharing a photo of the two on the Instagram collage. Prince William may have had a crucial role in convincing King Charles to appoint David Beckham as his charity ambassador, amid an ongoing feud between the Sussexes and the former footballer. The monarch allegedly sought advice from William before appointing the former England player as an ambassador of the King's foundation by King Charles. The pair also chatted about their shared passion for beekeeping, and the monarch was also impressed by the footballer's knowledge for the countryside. A source said, the King and David Beckham have really bonded over their similar interests. This is a massive thing for him and he's delighted. He is really passionate about his new role. The outlet reported that courtiers had previously cast doubt on Beckham in being suitable for the role, but William stepped in to vouch for the former footballer. The move comes amid an ongoing feud between the Beckhams and the Sussexes. The friendship between the two A-lister was once close, with David and Victoria attending the Duke, and the Duchess wedding at Windsor Castle in 2018. However, it has soured over the last few years. David was left absolutely furious after he and wife Victoria were allegedly accused by the Sussexes of leaking stories, with reports suggesting that their relationship was now over. A source told the Daily Mail, any making up now is so unlikely. Lizzie Cundy, a former friend of Meghan, also claimed that the Beckhams have slowly distanced themselves from the Sussexes. Cundy said, 
I think Victoria and David have slowly tiptoed away like the other friends. Many friends who went to the wedding have tiptoed away from Meghan.